Hello, my name is Andreas Schwope from Renaissance Electronics Europe. Today I want to introduce you to our Renaissance Win32 M3 Industrial Ethernet solution. In the following I will show you some technical details of our RIN devices and demonstrate how to compile and download the software on our IAR solution kit board. The demo uses a small EtherCAD application on our board running in a simple EtherCAD network. I will show you this demo with a TwinCAD master on the back of industrial PC. First I want to give you a short introduction into our RIN device. Besides the specific EtherCAD slave controller, the RIN is a multi-protocol device and is able to support other protocols as well, such as Profinet, Ethernet IP and others. Here Renesas provides a complete hardware and software environment with cooperation partners like IAR, Backoff, Port, TMG and others. The RIN device itself is an SOC with an ARM Cortex-M3 CPU and lots of memory for the stack and application software. It provides a lot of interfaces like Flash, I2C, UART, CSI, CAN, many GPIOs and an external host interface. Internally we find hardware acceleration features for EtherCAD, hardware RTOS, Ethernet frame processing and with an extended Ethernet switch and included FIs. In the following RIN demonstration, EtherCAD is used just a protocol example. Other protocols would have a comparable setup, but are not shown in this tutorial. Here you see the RIN solution kit board with its interfaces. First we connect the board to the IAR embedded workbench running on a PC. For this we use the IAJET light debugger, which is included in the kit. In the IAR workbench we can compile the EtherCAD demo, download it to the board, start and debug it. In a second step we build the EtherCAD network and connect the RIN board with a back of IPC, which is equipped with a screen, keyboard and mouse, and which is running the TwinCAD network tool. In general this IPC provides a standard PC environment. Instead of this, any other PC with a required network card can be used as well. Now I will show you how to compile and download the software on the RIN board with the IRR embedded workbench. For this step click the menu File, Open Workspace and open the project file in the EtherCAD IAR project folder. With the workspace selector on top you can select between internal RAM boot and serial flash boot. Here I will use the internal RAM boot option. If you compile the demo the first time, click on Project, Rebuild All. In other cases, a make is sufficient. To download the software, click on the Download and Debug button and start the debugging. Now we check if the board connection can be established with our EtherCAD master. For this we start the TwinCAD System Manager and switch it into Configuration Mode. With Load, I.O. Devices and activate free run. On the left side we can now open the EtherCAD devices and the RIN32 M3 box to see our board. We open both inputs and output entries and see the DIP switch and LED resources of our demo. We select the inputs and select on the right hand the online tab. By changing the switches on the board we see that the EtherCAD master is continuously reading those settings. For the outputs LEDs, we can now perform a write action with the following window. By writing a hex 55, every second LED is switched on. By writing a hex AA in a next step, we can see that all LEDs are turning their state. Similar demo setups are also available for Profinet and Ethernet protocols. The related software can be downloaded from the Renaissance website as well. This was my tutorial to set up and run our RIN solution kit in an EtherCAD environment. On our RIN website you can get further details about the solution kit and our RIN device family. Thank you very much for listening and goodbye.